Right now, just a story that will take your breath away. A 17-year-old wanted in the murder of a 14-year-old classmate. Really disturbing. And, and it all happened after a football game over the weekend. That 17-year-old is now on the run. This is all unfolding in Griffin, which is just about 40 miles south of Atlanta in Spalding County. Here's Atlanta News First reporter Rebecca Schramm. The school district stepped up security here at Griffin High School following Saturday's shooting involving those two students. We've seen several city of Griffin police cars coming and going from campus, and that is on top of the usual security, which includes a weapons detection system. It kind of helps me with calming down or whatever, but um, I am glad they added more security than it was before. Siblings Akaya and Demarius Murray tell me something told them not to go to Saturday afternoon's varsity football game between their school, Griffin High, and their biggest rival, Spalding High. The reason why I didn't go because I had a feeling like every time we do this game, it's always be a show. I kind of had, what, nightmares, the same nightmare um, three days before the game. So it was kind of like warning me not to go because somebody was going to get shot. As the game at Griffin Memorial Stadium was winding down, law enforcement officers working security heard gunfire. Less than a block from the stadium, police found the victim. Authorities identified him as 14-year-old Griffin High freshman Emmanuel Dorsey. He died at the hospital. Police quickly circulated a photo of the suspect, 17-year-old Kamarian Kendricks, taking out arrest warrants for him on several charges, including murder. They say he's not from the rival school, but from Griffin High, and that he and the victim knew each other. The Murray siblings didn't know either teenager other than in passing. Demarius says it's a life lesson. Just stay in school, stay out of the street because it ain't never trouble. Since students from both schools may have heard the gunshots or may have seen the aftermath, both Griffin High and Spalding High will have crisis counselors and mental health professionals available all week should students need them. In Griffin, Rebecca Schramm, Atlanta News First.